Hi there. So in this last lesson, I have shown you how to create a brand new Google AdWords account. So in this lesson, I will show you the basic interface of Google AdWords dashboard. So you could have seen this in the introduction or promo video. So this is how you look the Google AdWords account. So this is the overview. If I click this, you can see all campaigns. So if I create a multiple campaigns, you can see the list here. And since I have created only one campaign, you can see only campaign here. That is the campaign name is Hotel, right? So this is how the campaign reports will be reported in the main dashboard. Like these are the ad groups. So what are ad groups? The main mode of the campaign is to bring bookings for the hotel, right? So ad groups are segregated based on the keywords and intention of the searcher. That is. So if I going to click on search hotels, there will be a amount of five or six keywords here. So what else in Melangani Church, budget hotels in Melangani Church. So all these keywords are a common term, right? So hotels, church. So church hotels is the common term here. So it is grouped in the ad group like on my ad actually. So you can see this is the ad group. So this ad group contains keywords with the terms church hotel, right? So I have grouped in these keywords into that ad group. So lodge, Velangani is another ad. So you can see these keywords as terms lodges Velangani. So I have grouped this into a separate ad group. Why I'm doing this is to improve the quality score. So what is the quality score? I will discuss about this in the next lesson. So if you are writing ad copy, the keyword should match with the ad copy. So to do this, I have segregated in these ad groups with separate keywords here, right? So I will quickly jump on to all campaigns here. So these are the ad groups and these are the search terms that are triggered the ad in the Google search results. So if I go on hotel, hotels in Balancani, so it has got 15 clicks out of or not impressions here. So, and this is the best performing ad. Out of which 655 impressions, I have got 75 clicks with a CTR of 1.45, right? So these are the number of impressions or clicks I got from mobile phones. That is the blue color is indicating mobile phones and red color is indicating the tablets and so on the computer right so this is the networks google networks is the majority network where i publish my ads here and these are the timings when my ad is triggered right so next will be the recommendations google will recommend you some keywords and other methods to get your perf ad perform well on their so if you can view campaign here so it will see right so these are the art rotation and recommendations given by google here so next will be the ad extensions so i have created so many extensions here so you can see the extension by clicking the extensions tabs in the add and extensions tab here so this is the extension type of call extensions Suffix shown here in the introduction video i got loan calls using this extension right so if you use a directly click on this mobile number it will directly go to the dialer of the mobile so from there the user can just dial the hotel and call and inquire about the bookings right so next will be the landing pages since the hotel didn't have a separate landing pages and they don't want me to you know create a separate landing for that but i recommend to create a separate landing pages if you are running an ad for your business right so i just used the home page of the hotel and advertised it in the google so next will be keywords here so it will show the keywords with most clicks most impressions so you can just click on sort the ascending and descending order by clicking on this so next will be the audience so google have a predefined set of audience based on the affinity category so it will see what category is suits best for your business so next is demographics here 
so it will show the age gender and household income so in many countries household income is not available but in some countries like us it has the household income and other related details right so it, that's how the google dashboard looks like and it is the tools options here i can go and search for new york keywords using the keyword planner and if you are running a campaign active so you can you can go and search for your keyword and see where whether the ad is triggering by google right so this is the ad and manager and this is the conversions google analytics and other related stuff here so i will be sh showing this detail in the upcoming lessons for now just go and browse around this google adwords tool it's a very complex tool it will take some time to get mastered with this tool right so that's it for now i will see you in the next upcoming lessons bye bye